that sometimes the mass can be important. So you may have noticed I am dancing around a very large Jenga tower. Uh, and I thought I'd have this set up during my show uh, to artificially increase the amount of suspense for narrative purposes. No, so, uh, so this is to show a fantastic effect uh, about resonance. So this is a building, and we're going to show you in a second how a building resonates, hopefully, to destruction. We will see how lucky we get, or unlucky, depending on what I'm trying to do at the time. Uh, normally, you will hear resonance discussed when it comes to bridges. And so there are a lot of bridges which have had resonance problems dating back into, I think the earliest one I've come across was in the 1800s, up near uh, Manchester, where uh, Salford is now. There was a bridge, and there were some troops marching over the bridge because they were all in step. They hit a resonance frequency of the bridge. And the bridge started to move, which apparently they thought was kind of fun. So they started singing a tune to match the bouncing bridge, really got involved, and it collapsed. And <laughs> no one died. 